lawmakers have stated that they believe many will be terminated at the Department of Justice following the release of the FISA memo. From Free Market Shooter, link, fmshooter.com. In a flurry of headlines and statements amid a bombshell report by Sarah Carter, a memo outlining a classified document exposing extensive FISA abuse was made available to all House members late Thursday evening. From Carter's stunning report, the revelations from the memo could lead to the removal of senior officials in the FBI and Department of Justice. Carter then summarizes the truth behind Trump's wiretapping claim against Obama that ignited a firestorm in March of last year. The dossier was used in part as evidence for a warrant to surveil members of the Trump campaign. Former British spy Christopher Steele, who compiled the dossier in 2016, was hired by embattled research firm Fusion GPS. In October, the Washington Post revealed for the first time that it was the Hillary Clinton campaign and the DNC that financed Fusion GPS. In short, BuzzFeed's infamous Golden Showers Trump dossier was used as bogus reasoning to obtain a FISA warrant and spy on the Trump campaign. The real kicker, though, is the fact that Fusion GPS, who hired Christopher Steele, the originator of the unsourced dossier, was funded by both Hillary Clinton and the DNC. It should come as no surprise that the Democrats voted to block the release of the documents detailing the FISA abuses perpetrated by the Obama administration. Several lawmakers weighed in on the issue through Thursday night. Speaking with Fox News, the lawmakers said they could not yet discuss the contents of the memo they reviewed on Thursday after it was released to members by the House Intelligence Committee. But they say the memo should be immediately made public. It is so alarming the American people have to see this, Ohio Rep. Jim Jordan said. It's troubling. It is shocking, North Carolina Rep. Mark Meadows said. Part of me wishes that I didn't read it because I don't want to believe that those kinds of things could be happening in this country that I call home and love so much. Florida Rep. Matt Gates said he believed people could lose their jobs after the memo is released. I believe the consequence of its release will be major changes in people currently working at the FBI and the Department of Justice, he said, referencing DOJ officials Rod Rosenstein and Bruce Orr. Representative Matt Gates, RFL, also appeared on Fox Business to talk about the memo and called for complete transparency regarding the issue.